We now return to Let's Play Caves of Cud. I've decided that I'm going to go through at least one more episode of just exploration. I'm going to finish this off and then I'm going to head back to the Great Gate and go underneath and down that stairwell and uh, just see if I can take on whatever's there. Okay, uh, boar. There's a boar somewhere. Hiding in the shadows. Bastard. Bandage. I will take that bandage. And there is a turret there. A chain gun turret. I will move back here. I will use my electromagnetic pulse. I have to pay attention. It's still pulsed. Okay. <laughs> I'm... I was trying to make sure that I didn't accidentally run into that when it left off. Okay. So there's another thing about here. That's kind of a good indication, I guess. But if it's going to be another machine gun turret, I don't know that I want to be around here. But we're able to pick up a lot more meat, so that's good. I don't have to carry around these humongous corpses of animals with me so I can munch on them later on, oh, though. No. Okay. What is this? A metal folding chair. And a star apple. Good. Uh, there's another vine wafer more wooden arrows. These are really worthless to me. I mean, they're weightless, but they're really worthless to me even to have. Let's come down. Metal folding chair. Let's get rid of that. Got a flawless crystal out of it. Great. Vine wafer, vine wafer, vine, vine. Okay. Now this is... For a minute there I was a little bit excited. Oh. Um, not yet. Okay. Uh, well. There. I'll take that. And he's got ring mail and a steel war hammer. I'm getting awfully damn close to capacity here, so... I will have to make my way back to the Grit Gate. Hopefully by the time I get back, I mean, I don't know why they would, it hasn't been that long, but hopefully when I get back, um, there would be some new stuff I could trade for, because that would be swell. I'm not really sure how long it takes in-game for the traders to restock their supplies. Okay, well, it looked like there was a wall. Can I go? No. Damn. Looked like the wall continued on over there. Ah, here we go. Plastic tree? Carrying too much to move. Oh, no. Oh, yes. I have not put that holographic armband on yet, either. Um, that is not what I meant. So where could I put that? I've got a wooden buckler. Oh, I forgot this whole time I've been carrying that buckler. I could have totally put on one of these iron bucklers that I've been bypassing. Although that lowers my defense value considerably. You know what? Let's do... Um Let's add that. Now, do I have a special ability with that? How do I use it? Activate. Ah, okay. Well, I don't think I want to do that just yet. Because I'm not really in trouble at the moment. Pick up a star apple? Bloody star apple. Ah. It looks like there is a bandage over there. Can I... 
can I get through you? I can't get through you. Okay, so there's a whole section of the map right there that I am blocked off from. If I wanted to use my digging claw serum, I could grab it. But I don't, so I won't. And we're done there too. Okay. Well, I guess we go back this way then. There are no stairs down, so this appears to be it. Unless, of course, there was something through those walls. It was amazing. Uh, okay. So out we go. All the way over there. Up. And we're out of here. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Head down. Eat a salamander corpse. Yeah, okay. And then we'll head down. And we'll go find something to trade, possibly. Something to, uh... Now, now here too. Here too, actually. Wasn't this... This was the place, right? Where I was... Because I don't remember if it was this place or if it was, um... It wasn't Golgotha, so it must have been this place. Uh, where I can dig through a wall. Because there, there's a whole section left over there that I am not able to even look at. Yes, find me some stairs down. Find me some stairs down. Okay. So here we go. I'm going to save, just in case I do something stupid, like dump all my water on a very absorbent floor again. And let's see if maybe you have something new for me. You've got a shit ton of stuff for me. I should totally take that fix-it spray foam, because that could be very, very useful. Uh, compass bracelet. I must already have one of those, correct? And then the elastine. I need to actually look. I always do this. I always come here and then I don't know what I've actually got on my body. Not that one. So I've got the nylon body pack, which is helping me carry more. So I'm not actually carrying or wearing the elastine skin suit. The wiki says this actually helps against the cold, but um, I don't see that ability on here. Uh, chain mail, the Isakari banner, that's a secondary one that I've got that I don't especially need. Okay. So, let's take that. I'm wearing a compass bracelet. This is a second compass, compass bracelet. Steel boots. The glow sphere. Those dormant way droids, maybe, because I don't have any idea what they're useful for. Probably should hang on to at least one of those. Just in case I need to switch over, the buckler is not, uh, it's not too bad, but it's, and he's got a new recoiler too, interesting, he's got an electrified short sword, might be interesting, he's got a floating glow sphere, it's a little extravagant for me because I don't really need it, I could get some more food, I guess, is it just me or does he have like pretty much everything he had the last time we were here? Uh, I don't think I need that many more shotgun shells or that many more slugs, but how much more does it add? Not too much more. I'll carry it because it doesn't weigh anything. Now this. Well, if I wanted just both of those. I could not have both. I could take the trinket and the artifact I would have to leave. Yeah, that's not going to make any difference. So, that's an awful lot to give up for that. And what if I want to, I mean, if I traded this out for the artifact instead, I would have enough to go over to, what's his fate? You know, let, let's go trade with him first. I know, another boring episode. 
but I really do need to, to play this better. Empty injector, I don't know that I need that actually. And all he's got is stuff that's not really useful. Although he does have the data disk for that. I know how to make that a laser pistol though. Uh shit, I totally don't have totally don't have enough to even come close to that. And I don't have any back in Joppa. So I could just sort of come in with a treasure chest fill up my treasure chest like set it down right next to him just load it up again and again and again but by the time I come back he might not have the laser pistol plan anymore damn it well that would probably be at this point in the game probably an amazing advantage probably could not make it though okay well Ah, uh, Jesus. Let's go back and do this trade real quick, because I still need to go down those stairs. I will grab this, grab this. I at least want the food, and I think I'll turn the auto food back on now, because I don't have to really worry too much about that. We'll get rid of this, 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 this. That's an extra one. Glow sphere, I guess. Don't need it. You can't take it apart. Oh, we are way over, <laughs> way over what I need to spend right now. But if I wanted to also take that, it's still way too much. Well, these things are heavy, and I want to get rid of them. This is not too bad. Steel boots are also heavy. We don't need to get rid of that. Or that. Well, that's heavy. I want to get rid of that, actually. Um, I'll take the back of that. You know what? I'll, uh, I'll fiddle with this here in a minute. Alright, so I've worked it that he's got... He's going to be giving me those copper nuggets and... Uh, Shotgun shells, after all, even though I'm not using them at all. That's a good trade. Uh, at least it, it's good enough for now. So we'll call it good there. Uh, what else am I using too much of here? I could shove some things in that chest before going downstairs. Because, I mean, damn, that is heavy stuff. The Mirthworm Corpse is one thing. The Dreadroot Tubers are another that's costing me a lot of weight. The shotgun, and the rifle, and all this frickin' water. So... Yeah... I might need to, to rethink this. Let's go down for night right now, though. I can always run back up. We're, of course, going to save, because this is actually a lot more difficult than you might think. And there might eventually be a quest saying, hey, uh, go down there and clear that out for us, would you? Well, maybe it's not too bad. I just seem to recall that the last time I came down here, it got pretty crazy. Hey, hello? Treasure room. Why couldn't I pick that one up? I don't know, but did you see how much crap it gave me? Who, who is here? Close that door so we're not being disturbed. So I couldn't take it because that droid was looking at me? It's running away in fear. Okay. We'll uh, heal up there. Oh. More of you. Oh, I really don't want you stuck right there, though, because you're going to put slime everywhere. And there's a guy... somewhere. There you are. Isakari Sunveil. Does not actually help me, but I'll take this stuff anyway. 
I will take lacquered chainmail. If I do that, it's gonna. Well, it's, it's not too much, I guess. Fuck, we got some guys down here that are really annoying. Okay, we got an opportunity here to take some more crab legs. We'll take those. There. Okay, time to heal. Surrounded by my droid friends. More slippery sludge slime that makes it impossible to get around. Before I go there, I'm going to come down here. Nope, nothing there. Nothing here. This looks like it could have been a treasure room. there. Someone shooting. Oh boy. Okay, the droid can take care of it, maybe. Or I'll have to do it. A weird artifact. I'll take that. Take that. I also want that boar corpse. What are these? Examine. High explosive grenade. Good. Okay. But what is this one? Stun gas grenade. Mark II. Uh, I'm gonna have to get rid of those grenades because I never use them. Never, never use them. Giant centipede corpses. So I gotta remember there are corpses under here. Because if I need more food... Oh, where does this go? Uh, just in case it takes me up in the base where I'm not supposed to go, and there's no stairs back, I will save. Massive doors blocking my way, but this is where it goes. Okay. There's also stairway down... Uh, a sturdy Borderlands revolver. I will take all that, and then I will go ahead and replace my Borderlands revolver with the steady version. Or the sturdy version. Whatever. Same thing, right? Right. Big crab. Pig snout. Snout. Slug snout. Snout snout. Damn you. Oh, uh, I guess I don't need to do that, do I? I can wait for you to come to me. Okay. Eyeless crap. Oh, for fuck's sake. Time dilation. Electrofuge corpse. Oh, I'm hungry. Let's eat this. Shockingly delicious. Great. Let's get this. I am overweight. <laughs> Damn it. Drop that. Just drop the one. Heal up. Really? Okay. I don't know what those guys are all waiting for. There's another stairway up. Let's save this one, too. Up with that... No. No. Wrong button. Oh. What? Where... where what? Oh. Okay. I... Oh, well, whatever. I was wrong in my assumption that it was... Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Robodroids, help... Fourteen. Well, this is good. This is really good. Uh, back up. 
back up. I see, I don't really want the droids taking all of the kills because that is experience that I am going to miss out on. Experience that I desperately need at the moment. I will take all of that. It's bizarre, really, that these guys would have this stuff under here, right under their base, with a stairway, an open stairway, that leads right to it. Point this door. And they would not come down here and clear this out. Okay. Well, that's that's it for this floor, then. So I guess we'll go this way. And let's see. Yeah, I've got time. We'll go down one more floor. I have no idea what's at the bottom of all this. I don't even know if I want to go down here. I should have reloaded before I did this, but whatever. Another thing I should do, actually, is see if I can build another semi-automatic pistol. This is taking a long time to build this. Either this is going to be huge, or there's a lot of crap in it. If it is like a cavern level, then that means that there's going to be multiple floors we can open. Zone build failure. Um, okay. Well, uh, it's a good thing I saved because I think the game has thrown me into a void. That is what appears to have happened here. I mean, every... Chain gun turrets, rifle turrets. What the hell is going on? Uh, I don't know, but uh, this is not where I'm supposed to be. So we will be loading the map, and hopefully I can get back to where I was. Okay, well, I loaded, and this time, just before hitting the record button again, I went back down the stairs to see if it happened again. This time it actually put me in a place. I'm gonna sit back for a bit though and let the droids do their thing. I'll take that. Although like I said I should actually be getting in front of them and taking this on because that's experience. Uh... Uh... <laughs> Um, um, he's asleep while all of this is going on. You seriously attacked the bear. You seriously attacked the bear. Are you freaking kidding me? I'm gonna let you keep doing that. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, oh good lord. You just keep doing your thing, buddy. You got this. You got it. Oh god. Wait. Did did he kill it? I think he killed it. I didn't want to grab that chest. <laughs> I I wanted to open the chest. Okay, so we know it takes Uh, it takes um, three, apparently, three droids to kill a slumberling. Raw boar meat, which I will take. And the train just keeps coming. You know what? Let's uh, time dilate this. Ooh, a water skin. An albino ape pelt. That is exactly what I need to take, because, if we look at it, uh, provides me warmth. Well, fine, but I need to get it then, I guess, because that's not letting me look at it properly. Uh, look. Quip? Oh. 
actually just something you put on your hands or some stupid thing like that. You're carrying too much to move. God damn it. A bloody weird artifact. Let's examine it. It's a bloody stun rod with a chem cell in it. Okay, let's read it. I now know how to make one. And we'll take it. This is too much. This, this is all too much. I have to drop you. Fresh water. Okay. There were some stairs down. I really should have actually held back and uh, healed up a bit because I'm hurting just a bit. Fried processing core. I'll take that. What the hell is this place? This is crazy. Steel cookery, I'll take that. And that appears to be the end. Oh, I thought it was the end of the droid. It was not. Take that. Centipede corpse. Ouch. I'll be backing up, thanks. I'm going to come over here. See if I can't sit back and heal. And then hopefully by the time I get over here... More water that just put me over capacity. Damn you. What can I get rid of? What do I want to get rid of? Nothing really. Uh, wait, am I hungry? How? There we go. No, I'm not hungry. But I'm now going to have to drop something because I've got too much water. Um, Steel vine. That's actually probably going to be worth something I want to keep. Basic toolkit. I don't think it's actually worth anything in a trade. But I also don't want to drop both. I don't know how to get rid of the two. I don't know how to split them. So, I guess I drop a water skin then, because... That's just one too many. Banner, fur... There's more shit that way. Okay, we're gonna go back up. Do the, the trading and whatever to get me back down. I'm gonna shove some stuff into the, uh, the chest. So I'm not carrying so goddamn much. What have we found? This is ridiculous. Okay, that, there's that guy. Um, anything good to trade? Now that I <laughs> have come back with, uh, with a bunch of stuff that I'm not really sure... That lacquered chainmail is hanging on to, correct? I think that did it, actually. Because what am I... I was deciding to hold on to the, the body pack. But I want to look at this. 10% carrying capacity. Yeah. So... That was on my back, though. This is the reinforced rubber suit. So I don't actually need that, but I can put it away. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that on screen, and there's probably not going to be anything useful I can trade for. Maybe that last artifact or whatever the hell he had that was for 150, if I can come up with that much. Otherwise, I'll be trading it for scrap, I suppose. I'm going to end this one here. I'll see you next time.